and the next President of the United States, Ted Cruz. Down she goes, now to campaign 2016. Carly Fiorina taking a tumble on a strange day for presidential politics. And Ted Cruz comes face to face with some not so friendly protesters. CBS4 anchor Elliot Rodriguez joins us with the race for the White House. Elliot? Well, Ruta Bay, despite a deal with John Kasich, Ted Cruz is trailing Donald Trump in the polls in Indiana, where nothing seems to be going right for Cruz or for his running mate, Carly Fiorina. And the next president of the United States, Ted Cruz. Carly Fiorina dropped like a brick. Here it is again. It happened during a Cruz campaign event in Indiana, and Donald Trump wasted no time chiming in. She just went down. She went down a long way, right? And Cruz didn't do anything. I was a... Even I would have helped her, okay? It's not clear if Cruz saw Fiorina fall, but she got right up and the event continued as if nothing happened. God bless it's you part of a sir. busy Thank schedule much, for the Thank remaining for GOP me. candidates in a state where Trump is hoping for a knockout punch. Enjoy your lunch. Trump grabbed lunch at Shapiro's restaurant in Indianapolis, chatting it up with patrons and signing autographs. Are you going to eat all that? Cruz attended five campaign events. His day included this awkward encounter with a group of Trump supporters. And I'm running to be everyone's president. Those who vote for me, even those we who don't, don't want vote you. for me. Well, you're, you're entitled to your views, sir, and I will respect it. In fact, I will Do the protect. math. I will protect. You know, you ask cases right. to drop out. It's your turn. Well, Indiana has 57 delegates. A win tomorrow night would put Donald Trump over the 1,000 delegate mark. Elliot Rodriguez, CBS 4 News tonight. Elliot, thank you.